In the media, a terrorist's face is shrouded in a mask. A terrorist's mind is reduced to a set of threats and slogans. That makes it hard for us to fathom the human being behind the mask and the slogans. But this year, one fearless actor embraced the unfathomable role of a terrorist, bringing a full, powerful revelation of the humanity that can live in one's spirit along with the most inhuman cruelty. For his devastating performance as the extremist Bashir in The Invisible Hand, the judges have voted in Obi to Usman Ali. Thank you so much. Uh, it's really such a privilege to be here. Um, I'm sort of drawing a blank. I have a few things prepared. Um, first of all, I just wanted to say thank you to my wife, Melina, who's here with me. She's absolutely the most perfect human being I could have ever asked for in my life, so I'm so happy that she's here. My best friend, Kotaro, is here as well. I know I wasn't supposed to, but I'd like to thank my agent and my managers for being here as well, taking all my nagging phone calls. Uh, finally, also, uh, I really want to thank the entire uh, Invisible Hand team, particularly New York Theatre Workshop. It is by far the best experience I've had working in theatre in I don't know how long. They really, really have to focus on the work, and that is so important. Um, to Ayad Akhtar, who continues to write these plays. You know, if somebody had told me five, six years ago that I'd have the opportunity to be in two plays with a Pakistani lead, written by a Pakistani playwright, I'd say, get the fuck out of here. That's never gonna happen. But it's happened, and he's an inspiration to all of us. So I really, I really tip my hat to him. Thank you so much for that. Um, to my uh, director, Ken Rushmall, who apparently is very popular here. He was just amazing, led me through this very difficult role. My castmates, Jamil, uh, Darius, and Justin, and the entire team. Uh, finally, I have to give a shout out to Chicago Theater, that's kind of where I'm from. Uh, Woo! Proud to be, to learn how to be a real actor. Um, and I just want to tell you a quick little story. I moved to this country. Uh, 15 years ago, and because of the political ramifications of being a Pakistani, my parents were never allowed to actually come to see me here in this country for 15 years, denied visas over and over again, and so I thought they would never have the opportunity to see their son on stage. Then suddenly, thanks to this city, to this off-Broadway collective, to the New York Theatre Workshop, and shit just happening the right way, they got a visa, and they came, and I had the the experience coming out for a curtain call and seeing my mother and my father and my sister in the middle of the theater stand up and applaud and it is an experience I will never ever forget. I just want to say, because I think as actors, we all just kind of want our parents to really be proud of the work we do. And I thought I would never get that experience, and I did, thanks to New York City uh, and to the theaters here. So thank you again. Thanks to my family. Thanks to everybody else. Peace.